We continue with our topic trigonometry. Trigonometry. We treat cosine rule two. Just one example to understand the cosine rule better. Find your own side. The unknown side in the triangle. Now here is the triangle. This point is A, capital letter A, capital letter B, capital letter C. Angle B is giving us 102 degrees. And the side opposite this angle A is small letter A. The side opposite capital letter C or angle C is small letter C. The side opposite angle B is small letter B. Now two of these sides are given. C is giving us three centimeter and A is giving us five centimeter. All we have to do is to apply the cosine rule that is convenient with this. We have B square final is equal to A square plus C square minus two A C cos now that formula is convenient with the unknown side here. So we have b square, which is in this case is y square, it's equals to a square, which is 5 square, plus 3 square, minus 2 times 5 times 3, cos what? Cos 102 degrees. Now that makes everything interesting. Because you can find 102 in your four-figure table. So we have y squared is equal to 25 plus 9 minus 30. You solve this, you have minus cos. Cos cosine in the second quadrant is negative. Minus cos 180 minus 102 degrees. So y square is equal to 34 minus 30 times minus cos 78 degrees. As we get the 78 and we subtract 102 from 118. Now you'll notice the negative sign there. So y is equal to 34 minus 30 times minus 0 0.2079 which happens to be the cosine value for 78. Now minus times minus will change everything here. Minus times minus as you know already is times is plus is plus so we have 30 times 0 0.2079. Don't take note that this addition came from the multiplication of minus times minus. So y square is equal to y square is equal to 34 plus 6.2 3, 7. y square be equal to 40.237. Square root of both sides give us y to be 6.343 cm.